Hello and welcome to the Disney Stranger channel. I'm the Disney Stranger and today I'm at Walt Disney's Disneyland. That's right, I'm at Disneyland this afternoon and I'm not decided which park I'm gonna go into, but I'm definitely gonna go into both parks because I have a hopper pass. It's late afternoon, it's a late start today. I have just a few hours to have some great fun time between these two parks surrounding me. It's a hundred years of Disney celebration. 100 years! And this afternoon, I'm gonna have lots of fun here. I think I'm gonna pick Disneyland! That's where I'm going first. And then I'll head over to Disneyland California. So come with me tonight on my trip to Disney! So Disneyland Park is closing early tonight because of a sweetheart after dark party. They're the laminates for the special event and all these people waiting outside right now are ready to come in. But I have regular tickets for tonight so I'm just gonna go in the park for a few hours before this event happens, Disney after dark. Sweetheart night. Kind of like a Valentine's <laughs> Day uh, celebration. I don't have my sweetheart with me and Mrs. Stranger tonight. So I am just going to get in as much time as possible, get on a few rides, wander around, have some Disney fun, and then I'm going to head over to Disneyland California. So just come with me. We're going to have a fun late afternoon here at Disneyland. Welcome aboard everyone. This is the Horses Carriage. It was introduced in the park in 1957. Uh, this is Walt Disney's favorite vehicle, not favorite vehicle. His favorite vehicle was actually the fire engine, but he did drive this around too. Uh, he drove it every morning to make sure everything was working okay for the guests before they walked in. Uh, round trip on Main Street is about 2,000 feet, but we go about 23,000 miles a year, which probably doesn't really include a lot of the special events we take these to. For instance, uh, we uh, take these to weddings, we take it to parades, uh, the fire engine was actually in the Rose Parade uh, just a few weeks ago. Um, I also saw it pass by my house because I live in Long Beach and I didn't go on the Long Beach Pride Parade. So it's like, it's very funny to see my work just drive by my house. Yeah, and it would go about the top speeds of 35 miles an hour. Unfortunately, it only stick to five, so hold on tight. All right, so just remain seated at all times. Please keep your hands, arms, feet, legs, and elbows inside the vehicle. Supervise your children, no dancing in the aisles. But if you want to dance, you see me, okay? So this is cool. I haven't been on one of these cars in probably since the 70s. <laughs> The car was parked as I was uh, just coming into the park, so I'm like, hey, I gotta jump on and do this. <laughs> awesome. I feel like a VIP coming into the park now. You are a VIP. <laughs> Justin is our good driver for this uh, afternoon. <laughs> to think that Walt Disney actually drove in this very car is pretty amazing. <laughs> car drops off that in front of Adventureland uh -huh. uh, and then if you want to ride back you do have to get out and then come back in. Uh oh there's a duck. <laughs> oh boy. There's Ooh. a duck. No. <laughs> I don't stop for people but I stop for ducks. <laughs> Disney duck. Alright, here we are folks. Thank you so much for riding everyone. Enjoy the Thank rest you of your so day. much, Justin. Have we really appreciate it. Okay? Not a yeah. problem. Watch your step as you exit. Have a good rest of your night, everyone. So this is the vehicle we were just in. Ah. 
any Doctor Who fans out there, very similar to uh, Doctor Who's Roadster from the 1970s. That's uh, some Disney serendipity. Amazing. I guess uh, this will be my next goal to drive the fire truck or ride in the fire truck next time I'm here. Or maybe even tonight, we'll see. A bit of Disney nostalgia. This is pretty amazing. We got some uh, Disney 100 accents to the castle. This is pretty cool. It's pretty crazy to think this is like one-fourth the size of Cinderella's castle at Disney World. members around pressing the buttons to make it go up but I'm gonna give this a try so let, let's see if I can pull the sword out of the stone oh well maybe next time all right you know what I, I've been to Disneyland at least uh, a dozen times and I've never written storybook land I'm gonna give this a try while there's still light out so everyone can see it. You know, come join me and let's go on storybook canal boats. All the way in the front here. Thank you, Fred. And away we go. Join us. Hello, welcome to our journey to Storybook Land. My name is Brian and I'll be your captain and story teller for today. Please remain seated with hands, legs, feet, arms inside the boat, and parents, please provide your children. Oh, no cavities. <laughs> and just straight over to your left, you will see English Village. This is where Alice followed a white rabbit down a rabbit hole, down, 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 to Wonderland. And just right up ahead, we'll see a three cent table, one, two, and just right over to your left, you will see the villagers and the relatives. All the way on top of that mountain, you will see the castle where she went to the ball and found their French tournament. Party's in the park. Unfortunately, Mr. Toad is not home right now. He is probably somewhere in Spanish land in his modern parts. I'm just straight over to your left. You will see Arendelle. This is where Princess Elsa and Princess Anna found the true meaning of friendship and what true love really is. And just right up ahead to your right, you will see Prince Eric's castle. This is where he met Ariel and they both saw everything in Southern. Along the back, we wash your hands, arms, and fingers, and we should bring it into the calendar. Setting up for a band performance tonight here for the um, Valentine's Sweetheart Night. Looks very romantic. So, like they always say, exit through the gift shop. And that's what we're doing here at It's a Small World, exiting through the gift shop. I'm 
right by Pinocchio's journey here and does anyone see a hidden Mickey? I don't know, anybody? Hidden Mickey? Nah, maybe not. Okay, I've tried a couple kitty rides here at Disneyland, only because I've never tried them before. But now I'm heading into Galaxy's Edge. Yeah, I'm here. Finally, it's been a while. We got a couple of stormtroopers up there. Here on Batu, we have the Millennium Falcon. Never really noticed, but at night, the cabin is lit up here for the Millennium Falcon. Look inside. Check that out. Never noticed that. That's pretty awesome. What? Are you talking back to me? I think I just spotted a Sith Lord. Definitely see a Sith Lord. Look at that. Alright, before I leave Disneyland and head over to Disneyland California, I just want to share some Disneyland trivia with you guys. Right here on Main Street in this building located right in front of me is a shop from when Disneyland first opened in 1955. This shop was a lingerie shop. Can you believe that? On Main Street, you were at Wholesome Main Street USA. And also inside they had a an exhibit of the history of lingerie. It was called The Wizard of Bras. Imagine that, right there in that shop. As it's getting closer to the start of this Sweethearts Night here at Disneyland California, I'm noticing a lot of couples coming in with these lanyards with hearts around their necks. Looks like a very romantic night. Of course you know this had happened tonight. I think she said yes. Congratulations, guys. Hey, friends, I made it into Disneyland, California. We got Oswald here, my favorite character, Oswald. There, look at him. There's my buddy. Love Oswald. They should definitely do more with Oswald in this park. He's the original, he's the OG Disney before Mickey Mouse Oswald. And that's kind of why I love Disneyland California. I love this park because they show props to my favorite character, Oswald. It's gonna be a quick one, but hopefully my my point of being here tonight is to get on the Web Slinger ride because I haven't tried it out yet. It's a brand new ride here. A lot of people tried it. I haven't. First time back in a few years. So the last thing I'm going to do is get in line maybe uh, 10 minutes before the parks closes so I can ride it out. Uh, before that, I'd like to check out the, um, the Chinese New Year area. Like that's really happening and really cool. What I really like about Disneyland California at this time of year is the Chinese New Year. They have such a great area dedicated to Chinese New Year. Here we go, Chinese New Year at California Adventure. Check out this Mickey Mouse shaped hot dog bun. Is that cool? Mickey Mouse shaped purple sweet potato macaron. Look at that. And for the Disney stranger, Ting Zhao. There we go, Alex. Uh, All right, guys, I'm trying the Ting Zhao beer here, the Chinese beer, and it's got a bamboo blessing on it. That's that super foamy stuff that you're witnessing here. I don't know exactly what it is. It's not a beer foam. It's sweet. It's got a sweet topping on it. Very different. Never had a beer like this before. It's not a, a beer foam. It's definitely something added extra. That's pretty good. Cheers. Check out the Spirit Jersey. Happy New Year, guys. We got Chip and Dale. Chip with the black nose, Dale with the red one. And that's a pretty cool Spirit Jersey. What do you think? And this would be the front. 
year of the rabbit. Wrapped with love. What do we have here, guys? And we got the pork and shrimp wontons with a black garlic sauce for $8.75. The bo choy mushroom dumplings with black garlic sauce, $8.75. Red Dragon Spice Traders. At this kiosk, we have Red Spice Fried Chicken Bites. Guava Whiskey Cocktail. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, and then a beauty napkin. That's the uh, Goshang Yulot. Very yummy. I guess all the loved ones are over at Disneyland Magic Kingdom. But here at Disneyland California, we got the families. Chinese Lunar New Year, and it's Year of Oswald, Year of the Rabbit. There's our friend Oswald again and his girlfriend, Hortensia the Cat. And here's my favorite spot for the Lunar New Year here at Disneyland California, tucked in the back corner. So guys, here you have the Lunar New Year New Year's Wishes. Write your New Year's Wishes on the red tags and tie them to the wishing wall. So you write down your wishes and you stick them right here. Hopefully your wishes will come true. What's your wish for the Chinese New Year? So, what year were you born? The year of the dragon? The year of the snake? The year of the horse? The year of the sheep? The year of the monkey? The year of the rooster? The year of the dog? Or could it be the year of the pig? Maybe the mouse, the year of the ox, year of the tiger, year of the Oswald, or maybe year of the cat, Oswald's girlfriend. Would you like to know what year the Disney stranger is? The year of the rooster. All right, I got some food to eat, so I got the chopsticks here, and I have some Korean style uh, chicken with some broccoli and some steamed rice. And it looks delicious. It smells great too. And to wash it down, I got a black rice ale right here. And uh, I'm gonna give this a try too. Um, and thinking back to the other beer I had earlier tonight, the um, Ting Zhao with the fluff on the top, it, it was too sweet. By the end, I was like, uh, you know, Disney Stranger doesn't do <clears throat> sweet alcoholic beverages. Um, so I found it too sweet and beer and sweetness doesn't really go well for me. So here I have the black rice beer. Very crisp and refreshing actually. It's dark, but it actually tastes very light. And alcohol content is very low. It's actually below 4%. Love it, guys. This is really good. Great food here tonight. Having a great time. Don't forget your chopsticks. There's 10 minutes left here tonight, and I'm going to head over to Spider-Man Web Slingers on the Avengers campus. I've never been on it before. I'm really excited to see this ride. We shoot webs, and we do really crazy, weird stuff. I don't know. I've never been there before, but this is my first time. So join me on my first ride. I'm at the Avengers campus and I'm ready to ride the web slingers. It's all available to you. Hello guys, welcome. Come on in folks, come on in. Peter Parker. Hey, what's up? I'm Peter Parker. And here at Web, we have access to some pretty awesome technology. Hey, Peter Parker. 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 Hey, guys, what's up? I hear you have a book problem. I'm here to help. Everyone head to the stairs with 
see much to stop the Sparta bus before they destroy the campus. Grab a seat and get those web vision targeting glasses on. We got spider bots to web up. There's my guy, Oswald. So I have some Chinese New Year's merch right here. Check this out, guys. All the Disney rabbits. From Zootopia to Alice in Wonderland. Look at that. So this jacket is uh, $89.99. I like that. And these ears with Alice in Wonderland and Zootopia. These ears are $44.99, and they are pretty amazing. This lounge fly Disney Parts is $85, and there's Alice in Wonderland's White Rabbit. These bags are a little different, they're a little bit more narrower than wider, and they're pretty cool. And we have the lining, and we have one of the Disney rabbits there with bow buns. Check that out. These lounge fly wallets are 50 bucks, $50. We have the uh, Chinese serving trays. That spin, look at that. Which Disney rabbit will we land on tonight? $24.98 for the black t-shirt. This long women's blouse is $39.99. That's pretty cool. Sweatshirt for $59.99. This year the rabbit blouse, which is pretty cool. Thumper from Bambi is $44.99. So thanks again guys for joining me on this Disneyland adventure here at the Disneyland Resort at Disneyland and Disneyland California. I really appreciate you guys stopping by and checking out these videos and my wanderings here throughout the parks. I really appreciate it. But remember, before we go, there's one thing we always say. Don't forget to walk forward! Oh, have a great night! Thanks for watching guys. I really hope you enjoyed this video. Please click the like button below. Your comments are welcome. Don't forget to click like and subscribe to the Disney Stranger channel. And walk forward. <laughs>